have a good day students today i will discuss about types of dc generator there are two types of dc generator one is separately excited dc generator and another one is self excited dc generator at first we will discuss about separately excited dc generator A DC generator whose field magnet winding is supplied from an independent external DC source is called a separately excited DC generator. I am just sketching the picture diagram of separately excited DC generator. Here IF is field current, IA is armature current and IL is load current. This is load and this is our armature and this is armature resistance and EG is generating MF. So here the winding magnet is supplied from an independent external DC source. So this is called separately excited DC generator and we all know the EM generating EMF equation of DC generator is EG equals to E phi Z M by 60A. Okay. Here P is number of pole, phi is flux per pole, Z is armature conductor, number of armature conductor, N is rotation per minute, A is number of path through armature. Now we will discuss about self excited DC generator. Self excited DC generator are three types. First is series generator, second is sand generator, third is compound 
generate at first we will discuss about series generator in a series zoom generator the field winding is connected in series with armature winding so that whole armature current flows through the field winding as well as the load so i am just sketching the diagram So what I have just told, in a series zoom generator, the field winding is connected in series with the armature winding so that whole armature current IA flows through the field winding as well as load. So here the armature current equals to series field current equals to load current okay and the generating emf equation so this is the terminal voltage sorry load voltage so p equals to eg minus i which is this i is maybe IA or IAC or IL all are same in series so I RA plus RSE RA is armature resistance RAC is series field resistance okay now we will discuss about sand generator First, I'm just sketching the picture. This is load. This is voltage. This is armature this is sand field we are generating emf armature resistance armature current the current flows through two direction from here one is going through the series uh, one is going through the sand field and another is going through the load this is called load current because of this is generator so armature current will flow through the field and load okay so this is sand field this is sand field resistance here the sand field current ish equals to what voltage by sun field resistance because of ohm's law v equals to ir here the armature current 
going through two direction one is going through the sun field current sun field and another is going through the load so ia equals to ish and il okay and the terminal voltage v equals to eg minus ia R A. Why? Because here armature current, sun field current, and load current are different. Okay. Now we will discuss about compound generator. Actually, compound generator are two types long sand compound and short sand compound. There are two types of compound generator long sand compound and short sand compound at first i am just sketching the figure this is for long sand compound sorry this is for short sand compound What is compound generator? In a compound wound generator, there are two sets of field winding on each pole. One is series, another is parallel with the armature. And what is short sand compound? Short sand compound is the generator where only sand field winding is with parallel with the armature winding. Only sun field winding is parallel with the armature winding. Here, just look only the sun field winding is parallel with the armature winding. And what is long sun compound? Here, both the sun field winding parallel, sorry, not both, here. The sun field winding is parallel with the both armature winding and series field winding. So long sun compound is only sun field winding is parallel with the armature winding and sorry, short sun compound is only sun field winding is parallel with the armature winding and long sun compound is sun field winding is parallel with the both. Series field winding and armature winding. So for short sand 
the Here, the series field current is is in series with load current. I think I am just trying to say that the series field is series field winding is series with the load. So I S equals to I L series field current equals to load current, and the sun field current I S H equals to V plus I S E R S G by R S H. Okay, the terminal voltage V equals to G minus I A R A minus I S E R S G. And for long sand, here I S E equals to I A. Look here, this I A armature current equals to series field current. These two are in series equals to I L plus I S H. Here the current go through two different path, sand field winding and the load. So I S equals to I A equals to I L plus I S H. So this is series field current sun field current I S H equals to V by R S H according to Ohm's law. This is also according to Ohm's law, and V equals to E G minus I A plus R A plus I S H. So here the types of DC generator. There are two types of DC generator: self-excited DC generator, separately excited DC generator. For separately excited DC generator, what? Gen a DC generator whose field magnet winding is supplied from an independent external DC source is called separately excited DC generator and the self excited DC generator with three types series generator, sun generator, compound generator, series generator, armature and field winding both are in series in sun generator, armature and Field winding both are in parallel in compound generator. There are two types of compound generator long sun compound generator, short sun compound generator. In long sun compound generator, both armature winding and series field winding is in parallel with sun field winding. In short sun compound generator, only armature winding is parallel with the sun field winding. So, for more question and any queries, please contact me and you can comment in the comment box for any query thank you